but still tough to do? Um, still tough to throw it a little bit, but you know, I feel like I'm getting strong each and every day. And, uh, you know, it's going to keep plugging at it. So, you know, get ready to go out and, and uh, try to play great. Mike, how do you you approach this? You know, you're four and eight right now. How do you approach this situation where is it just a just desperate, just a desperation last final four games here? Or? I mean, it's a, you're right. It's a desperation last four games, and you know we want to finish strong. And we know how important that is. It's unfortunate that we're in the situation that we're in now, but uh, it's nothing we can do about it. And, you know, we, the best thing we can do right now is just win the next game. Get a win against Miami. And, you know, it's going to be a tough game because they have a very good football team and very good defense. So, uh, you know, we're going to have to do the things that are going to put us in a position to win the game. But it's very important that we finish Like, to avoid the injuries uh, moving forward, did you, you change up the game at all? I'm slacking. Uh, I'm getting there. I made my mind up. You know, it, it's, it's going to be times where I can't get the extra yards. I got to get down. You know, I get too caught up in the game sometimes. But, you know, that, that leads to you being sidelined. Being accountable for your team on those Sundays and not being out there, so I don't want to continue to put this team through that. And I understand, you know, how drastic that can be. Well, why, after all these years, do you think this time you learned your lesson? Uh, you know, I broke three ribs, and you know, I'm still sore behind it. And I could have been out there on the field for the last three games, uh, helping my football team, regardless of the situation. Um, so, you know, I, I just know it was, it was a situation where I had total control of, and I still do. You know, each and every time I, I step outside of the pocket. And I, I just got to start playing smart, playing, being conscious about what I'm doing um, when I'm in the moment. How frustrating is it to change and really not play the way you want to <clears throat> nah, I'm still going to play the way I want to I'm just going to get down. So, it's not worth taking a hit for an extra one or two yards unless the first down mark is right there. So I guess I still haven't changed. Mike, what, what, does that mean you'll slide? Uh, the best way I can. I slide the best way I can. I got to go ahead first or the knee slide. Have you been practicing slides? No, but I need to. Something that I haven't mastered over the last two years, so you know, hopefully I get there. Mike, is it believable to think that, that a team that has turned the ball over so much this season can, can all of a sudden just stop essentially any, over this final, you know, yeah, quarter I, of the season? I think so. You know, we control, you know, the, the turnover, the turnover battle. You know, uh, you know, obviously, you know, we want every play to be perfect. We don't want to put the ball on the ground. We don't want to throw the ball to the other team, but. <clears throat> I think at the end of the day, you know, when we're playing in the game, in the game we have to be conscious of what we're doing. And turnovers are going to happen. And, uh, you know, it's better to have one instead of three or four. So, uh, usually that team doesn't win the game. So, we just got to be conscious of that. Will you wear any protect, extra protective padding on something? Absolutely. I have on my equal protective gear on this week. I didn't wear it the last time, so I wear it this week. Mike, when it comes to avoiding hits, does part of that also involve getting rid of the ball quicker or, or throwing it away rather than trying to hold on and make a play at times? Uh, I think it all depends on the situation. <laughs> you know, you, you can't control when you're going to get hit inside the pocket or outside the pocket. And uh, certainly when you're waiting on gas to come up, and, you know, it, it's, it's all about what's going on at the present time. Uh, so, you know, the key is just to get the ball out as fast as you can, if I can, and, uh, you know, just play the game. Mike, you. Uh,